Welcome back to this class. In this class, we will see solid state chemistry in unit number 2 and some important questions from solid state chemistry. Defects in crystals. The disruptions in the periodic order of the crystals are called defects. The reason for this defects is to gain more thermodynamic stability. In order to get thermodynamic stability, crystals are getting defected from the orderness to the disorderness to get lower energy. Defects in crystals are also known as imperfections in solids. Usually point defects are classified into three categories, stoichiometry defects, impurity defects and non-stoichiometric defects. Stoichiometric defects are usually found in non-ionic solids and also in ionic compounds. Non-stoichiometric defects are classified into two categories, metal excess defects and metal deficiency defects. The third type of defects in solids is impurity defects. These are usually because of the impurities present in the solids. Stoichiometric defects in non-ionic solids are of two types, vacancy defects and interstitial defects. Vacancy defects are because of missing of lattice sites in the crystals. These are usually formed during the formation of the crystals and when the substance is heated. While heating the crystals, some of the molecules moves away from the crystals and leaving the site lattice sites vacant. Because of the vacancy in the lattice point, the density of the crystal decreases. Interstitial defects in non-ionic compounds. These interstitial defects are due to atoms or molecules occupies in the interstitial sites of the crystal, leaving its position vacant. In ionic compounds, stoichiometric defects are of two types. One is the Schottky defect and the another one is the Frankel defects. In Schottky defect, a pair of cation and anion is missing from its ionic crystal and leaving its original position in the lattice point vacant. This Schottky defects are formed during the crystallizations and also while heating the crystals. Since there is a vacant site in the Schottky defect, the density of the crystal decreases and it is shown by highly ionic compounds which have high coordination number example NaCl, KCl and AgBr. Here we can use one mnemonic to remember the short key defect in short key defects that is a decrease in density. Short means shorter so we can S for S short key means decrease in density of the crystal. Here AgBr can have both the short key defect and Frankel defect. Another one major category of defects in stoichiometric defect is Frankel defect. It is mainly because of the displacement of an ion from its position to its interstitial position. The ion usually displaced is a cation. In a molecule usually cations have the smaller size and the anion have the largest. In Frankel defects, because of the small size of the cation, they will dislocate to the interstitial position. Since the ions are moved towards the interstitial position, in this defect, there is no change in the density of the crystal. Impurity defect is a third type of defect. In this defect, a cation or an anion with a different oxidation number is added to the crystal will make this type of defect. Non stoichiometric defects are of two types metal excess defect and metal deficiency defect. As the name suggests metal excess defects metals are in excess to that of the anion and there are anions in the crystals. The extra cations will take the position of interstitial sites in the crystal. Negative ion is absent from its lattice sites 
and this position is occupied by an electron to maintain the electro neutrality of the crystal since the vacant sites are occupied by the electron it will create an f centers two main causes of this f centers are they are colored because of the electron is present in its vacant site they are paramagnetic because of the unpaired electron present in the vacant site usually compound such as zinc oxide cadmium oxide iron oxide and chromium oxides have this kind of defects metal excess defect the second major defect in non stoichiometric defect is metal deficiency defect in this defect the number of metals are lower in number than the number of cations because of the metal deficiency defects the molecular formula is represented in a different way than the usual one for example for ax crystal after the metal deficiency defect we can mention as a1 minus delta x where delta is the fractional decrease in the number of metal in the crystal in order to maintain the electron neutrality of the crystal the one of the metal in the crystal will have higher oxidation state than the usual one because of the non stoichiometric defects the metal excess defect or the metal deficiency defects both are acting as semiconductors now we will see some questions in the defects of the solids or crystals the first question is which of the following statement is wrong the first statement is short key defects occurs in metal as well as lattice crystals and decreases the density of the crystal this statement is the right one short key defects occurs in both metals and ionic crystals and because of the short key defects the density of the crystal decreases because there are two vacant sites for the anion and the cation in the crystal the next statement is frankel defects increases density of the crystal because it consists of the interstitial ions and atoms as we have seen already frankel defects is due to the dislocation of atoms to the interstitial positions but it is not removed of its from its position so in frankel defects there is no change in the density of the crystal but because of the frankel defects there is an increase in dielectric constant of the crystal the next statement is in crystals of silver halides high diffusivity of silver ions cause frankel defects this statement is also the right one in silver halides silver ion has the smaller size that means the cation has a smaller size and the anions the halide ions are bigger than the cation silver hence the silver ion diffuses to the interstitial position and causing its original position vacant the next statement is in short key defects equal number of cations and anions are missing this is also a true statement in short key defect in order to maintain electron neutrality both equal number of cations and anions are missing from its position metal deficient defect is a non stoichiometric defect which act as a dash type semiconductor in metal deficient defects the number of metal atoms are lower in number than the cations the vacant sites created by the metal act as a positive holes and this metal deficient defect crystals act as p type semiconductors likewise in metal excess defect crystals the vacant sites are occupied by extra electrons these extra electron will act as n type semiconductors in metal excess defect crystals now we will see about the band theory of solids 
the molecular orbitals of the atoms so closely spaced and they will form as bands a state of energy and these bands are separated as valence band and the conduction bands the gap between the valence band and the conduction band play a major role to predict whether the metal is a conductor or a insulator or a semiconductor in metals the overlapping of the conduction band and the valence band are there so metals are conductors of electricity in semiconductor the gap between the valence band and the conduction band is appreciable when there is a rise in temperature when there is a thermal vibrations the electrons from the valence band move to the conduction band they will act as a semiconductors in insulator the gap between the valence band and the conduction band is large so that the movement of electrons from the valence band to the conduction band is not possible hence insulators cannot conduct electricity semiconductors are of two types intrinsic semiconductor extrinsic semiconductor intrinsic semiconductors are of the type they will conduct current without doping or adding impurity from other oxidation states of elements example group 14 elements like arsenic and antimony will conduct current without doping other elements and they are called intrinsic semiconductors extrinsic semiconductors are of two types n type semiconductor and p type semiconductor n type semiconductors are because of doping a conductor semiconductor by using electron rich impurity like arsenic from group 15 elements since doping with a group 15 element the extra electron form a donor level near the conduction band the electrons from the donor level conduct the current p type semiconductors are doping an impurity with group 13 elements or electron deficient impurities these electron deficient impurities will create a positive holes near the valence band they will accept electron from the valence band hence the positive holes will make the semiconductors as conductive superconductors are the conductor they do not offer any resistance for the flow of current through the conductor the conductivity of some metals changes abruptly near the liquid helium temperature that is below 10 kelvin and do not offer any resistance for the conduction of current in the graph increasing the temperature versus the resistivity for the semiconductor with increase in temperature the resistivity decreases up to some extent and but for the metals and the superconductor with increasing temperature the resistivity increases that mean by increasing the temperature the metals and the superconductors are decreasing their conductivity but semiconductor increases their conductivity common superconducting materials are alloys of niobium niobium and titanium superconductor have the property called mesner effect mesner effect means at a particular temperature the expulsion of magnetic field appears at that point many metals behave as superconductors they will not offer resistance for the conduction of current now we will see some question the band structure of n type semiconductor is so options are given the first option the fermi energy level near to the conduction band the next level the fermi energy level near to the valence band the third option there is no fermi energy level the fourth fifth, fourth option the both the conduction band and the valence band are merged 
If both the valence band and the conduction band are merged, they will become as a conductor. The third option, there is no energy level, Fermi energy level between the valence band and the conduction band. Hence, it can act as a intrinsic semiconductor or like a insulator if the band is band gap is very high the second option the fermi energy level is near to the valence band it will act, act as a acceptor level so it is for the p type conductor because of the positive holes act as the acceptor levels in the option one in the option one the fermi energy level is near to the conduction band so n type semiconductors have the donor level near to the conduction band so for the n type semiconductors the option one is the band structure for the n type semiconductor next question is the flame color of the metal ions are due to the options are frankel defects metal deficiency defect short key defect and a metal excess defect the color of the flame occurs for the metal is due to the presence of free electrons in the crystal. In Frankel defect and Schottky defects, there is no free electrons. In metal excess defects, the vacancy position created by the anions are occupied by electrons. These electrons will give color in the flame. So metal excess defects will give color in the flame. Next question is, which of the following crystals does not exhibit Frankel defect? The options are silver bromide, silver chloride, potassium bromide and zinc sulfides. We know that already short key defects are favorable for compounds with high ionic compounds and a high coordination number. In potassium chloride they have the comparable ionic size and the coordination number is also higher. So they can form only short key defects. But others, AgBr, AgCl, and zinc sulfides will form Frankel defects. But silver bromide can form both Frankel defects and Schottky defects. But KBr can form only Schottky defect, but not the Frankel defect. Thank you for watching this session. I hope this session will be useful to you. Thank you so much.